Happening today, family and friends will celebrate the life of a Northland husband and father. The Chad Rogers Memorial Run happening right now. Lisa Benson live in Pleasant Valley. I hear there's quite a turnout there, Lisa. That's right. Hundreds of people out here, and you can take a look behind me and see family and friends are here to support Chad Rogers. In fact, the run should start any minute now. I'm joined now live with his father, Greg Rogers. One, talk to me about Chad's love of running, and talk to me about all the people standing here behind you. Oh, it's just amazing. Chad, um, yeah, really started running when he was very young and uh, ran cross country through high school, and then kind of gave it up for a while, and then, then the marathon bug hit him. And uh, but uh, this show of support is just phenomenal. Um, we're trying to do what we can to, uh, to help um, uh, Matthew uh, with his future college plans. And uh, so this is, uh, this is just an amazing event for us. So This is going to ask you, um, talk, talk to us about why you guys are even doing this run and who is, what it's going to benefit. Right, it benefits um, the Chad Rogers Memorial Foundation. We better hold off just a second if that's okay. Well, that's the beauty again of live television. You can take a look and see again the whole crowd honoring Chad. Lisa Benson live as they are singing the national anthem at the Chad Rogers Memorial Run in honor of Chad, who was found this summer after uh, uh, being found dead in a porta potty. After a run, a tragic story. We'll have much more on that coming up later in today's newscast. All this